So glad you're here. It's me, Wyatt. <laughs> Hi, puppy. Welcome to Storybrook Village, where all our fairy tale friends live. <laughs> hey, it's computer time at school. Let's go. <laughs> Hi, Wyatt. Okay, guess what? Today, we're learning about geography. It means learning about places and people all over the world. Oh, geography. Cool. For your geography lesson, I want you to figure out where our computer friend here lives. Hello over there. Oh, cool. Hi, how are you doing? Okay, I live in a place that's surrounded by water, known for kangaroos, and... Uh-oh! Web girl? Oh, no! Well, what happened? <gasps> Where did she go? Oops. <laughs> Looks like those are the only clues you're gonna get. See if you can figure out where she lives while I fix the computer. Okay, our computer friend said she lives in a place surrounded by water with kangaroos. So... Where in the world is that? I don't know. Me neither. Uh-oh. This is a super big problem. And a super big problem needs us, the Super Readers. We need to call the rest of the Super Readers. Call them with me. Say, calling all Super Readers. Calling all Super Readers. To the book club. To the book club. To the book club. Come on. To the book club! Quiet here! Woof, woof. P is for pig! Red Riding Hood rolling in! Princess P at your service. And you, say your name. Great, we're all here. Together, we will solve our problem. Let's go. Okay, Pig, state our problem. We need to figure out what place is surrounded by water and has kangaroos. Woof we do. Woof. How can we figure out where in the world that is? Excellent question. When we have a question, we look... In, in a book. book! Which book shall we look in? Peas and carrots, carrots and peas. Come out, please, please, please! Let's read the title of this book. Around the World Adventure. We know what to do. We need to jump into this book and find the answer to our question. First, we look for super letters. And then, put them in our super duper Computer! Super duper computer, how many super letters do we need? In this story, we need three super letters. And then we'll get our super story answer. It's time to transform. Ready? Ready! Come on, puppy, you're coming too. Woof! Super duper! Arms in! Put your arm in! Super readers! To, to the, the rescue! rescue! Alphabet! With alphabet power! Wonder Red! With word power! Read. 
into this book. Super readers to the rescue. It's time to fly with the super readers, because we've got a problem to solve. Super readers to the rescue. Super readers working together. Read. Why writer? Highlight. Read with me. One day, Wobblebottom got a postcard from his friend Sophie the Seal. Oh, boyza! Sophie invited Wobblebottom to come and visit her. Oh, boyza, boyza! Wobblebottom wanted to visit but did not know where Sophie was. Where in the world is Sophie? And that, Super Readers, is why we are in this book. We need to figure out where in the world our friends are. Let's roll! Wobble Bottom, we are the Super Readers. Super Readers? Oh, boys. Boyza, boyza! I need to find my friend Sophie, but I don't know where in the world she is. We're here to help. Howdy. Oh, hello there, Moose. Do you know where Sophie the seal is? Sophie? She was here, but she left. Oh. You just missed her. She's in the jungle in South America. It's really far away. How do we get there? Follow me. I'll take you. We go straight across North America and then down across the ocean. Well, here we are, South America. Okay, now you just need to find the jungle. Look for vines and big bugs. Bye. Ta -ta! Look, I see vines. I see bugs. Big bugs. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> that must be the jungle. It's on the other side of this. This quicksand. Wait a minute. What is quicksand? Woof! Tell you what any word means. Quicksand means loose, wet sand that things sink into and get stuck in. Quicksand. Now we know what it means. Whoop you! Give your tail a wag. Huh? So things sink into quicksand. Whoop. Yep. And we are standing in quicksand. So that means we're sinking in quicksand! What? I'm oh, oh, yeah. yeah. uh, Double drats, we're stuck! How can we get out of this quicksand? Alpha Pig to the rescue! With my amazing alphabet tools, I can get us out of quicksand. We can make a big rope to pull ourselves out of the quicksand. A, B, C, sing with me. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, and T, U, V, W, X, Y, and Z, sing with me. Now we need to find all of the letters in the word rope. So, first, where is the letter R? There! There's the R. Now we need the letter.
letter O. Where's the O? There! There's the O. Now the letter P. Where is the P? There! There's the P. Come on, P. Okay, now we need the E. Where's the E? There! There's that E. Hurry up, E. R, O, P, E. Rope! Okay, grab on. One, two, three, pull! Come on, guys, keep pulling! Hey. rope and pulled ourselves out of the quicksand. And just in time. Let's give ourselves a big thumbs up. You see a super letter? Which one? P! P! Uh-oh, it's in the quicksand. Better catch it before it sinks. Let's put it in our super duper computer! Two more super letters and then we'll get our super story answer! Super job, super readers! At last! Oh, we made it to the jungle! But where is Sophie? Sophie! Sophie? <laughs> Monkey, have you seen my friend Sophie? Sophie? She was here. <gasps> but she left. You just missed her. Sophie went to the bamboo forest in Asia. <laughs> but how do we get to Asia? <laughs> I'll take you. Just cross the ocean. Go down around the tip of Africa, and then straight up until you hit land. Here we are in Asia. Now, look out for bamboo and panda bears. Sophie won't be far behind. Ooh. Thanks, monkey. <laughs> Don't mention it. Bye-bye. <laughs> Goodbye. Here's some bamboo. Righto! Now, where's Sophie? We should ask a panda bear. Uh, Woof! Uh, guys? Hello? Hey, I can't see a panda bear. I can't even see me. Mm, this fog is like being in a big wet cloud on the ground. <laughs> How will we find a panda bear through this? Fog! You the sparkles. You the music. Princess Presto to the rescue! With my magic spelling wand, I can spell the word sun to make the sun come out, and that will make the fog go away. Spell with me. What letter makes the sound s? S! Wands up. Write a lowercase s with me, like a little snake. Splendid s! Now, what letter makes the sound ah? Uh? U! U! Let's write a lowercase u. Nice u writing! Now, what letter makes the sound N? N! N. Write a lowercase n with me. Nice! N. S. U. N. Sun! Presto! <laughs> wow, look at awesome. that! Awesome! Spectacular spelling! We spelled the word sun, and the sun dried up the fog. Let's take a bath. 
The sun helped us see again. Phew! And now we can go look for a panda bear. And Sophie. Do you see a super letter? Which letter did you find? A! A! Let's put it in our super duper computer! One more super letter, and then we'll get our super story answer. Right on, readers. Check it out, Panda. Hello, Panda Hi. Bear. Hey, Panda, my bear. Uh, have you seen my friend Sophie the Seal? Sophie was here, but she left. You just missed her. Now she's in Africa, in the desert. Oh, 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 let me. Say no more. I'll take you. We need to go down to the ocean and then turn towards the desert. And here we are in the desert in Africa. Oh, Camel can help you. Bye bye. Bye. Oh, camel! Oh, camel! Have you seen Sophie? We know, we know. We just missed her. Hmm. But there's no... How? I see ice and penguins. Where is that? Camel? Camel? Huh? What's it? Under here? Nope. No camel! Wobble bottom. This picture of Sophie won't help me find her. But that's all I have. It's even in my story, see? Wobble bottom has a picture of Sophie. How am I going to find her now? Super wide to the rescue! With the power to read, I can change this story and save the day. Okay, super readers. Wobble Bottom needs help finding Sophie. Let's change the word Sophie in this sentence. Zap! Why writer, write. What will help Wobble Bottom find Sophie? A picture of the sun, a picture of the quicksand, or a picture of the world? Let's try the world. Which are the words the world? The second word starts with a W. There! There! Zap! Let's read. Wobble Bottom has a picture of the world. <gasps> it's a picture of the whole world! It's a... it's a... map! Let's look at the map to figure out where Sophie is. Do you see ice and penguins? There! I see ice and penguins right there in Antarctica. Ooh, ooh, let's go there. Let's follow the map across the water. Oh, ice, penguins. Wobble the hot Oh, boys! Uh. Did looking at the picture of the world help us find Sophie? Yes! Yes! <laughs> yes. Super job, super readers. We changed the story and saved the day. Thanks, super readers. Thanks. Bye bye. You're welcome. Bye. bye. You see a super letter? Which letter did you find? M! Yeah, the letter M. Let's put it in our super duper computer. We found all of our super letters. Now we can get our super story answer. Fly flyers, back 
back to the book club. Come on, Wolfster. Woof! We found the silver story answer with silver wine. Give us our super story answer. Read the letters with me. M A P Map. The super story answer is Map. But why? Because Wobblebottom found Sophie by looking at a map of the world. So our question is, how can we find out where in the world our friend is? And our answer is... Map! I bet there's a map in our classroom. We can look at that and find out where our friend lives. Let's do it! Oh, look! Here's a map of the world! Awesome! First, let's look for a place surrounded by water. Hmm... This place has water all around. And look! There's a kangaroo! That place is called... Australia. A Australia! Our friend lives in Australia. Let's go ask her if we're right. Just in time. So, did you figure out where I live? We think so. Do you live in Australia? Yeah! I live in Australia! So cool! What do you like to do for fun? Well, there's a lot of beach here, so I like to go surfing. <gasps> I like to surf too! <laughs> Neat! You should come visit me sometime! Sure! And I'll know just how to find you. With a map! <laughs> <laughs> hip hip hooray! The super readers save the day! Hip, hip, hooray! Hooray! The super reader saved the day. We changed the story. We solved the problem. We worked together so hip.